You're beating him up. You're beating him up. Oh my goodness. What is up guys? We are at my house. We have Brandon all dressed up in a, what is this, an ostr ostrich suit? Yes. We have Brandon, he's part of the crew. That's right, we have Amelia right here. What is up? Peyton. Oh, there's Buzz Lightyear coming? Yes. Look, there's a, per there's a person dressed up just like Hillary. There's just like Hillary, right there. <laughs> What's up? Here they come. Here they come. Here they come. 300 people right now already. Oh my goodness, here they come. All right. Trick or treat, guys. And then this, is that Bob the Builder? Who is that? No, that's a Lego person. Oh, it's Legos? Okay. All right. Tell everybody hello, Suzanne. <laughs> What's up from Oklahoma? All right. He's got the whole mask. He's a Lego? He's a Lego fire. Yeah? Yeah? He's a Lego. Cormac, what do you say to her? And what else? Say go north. Hey, Ryan, how you doing? <laughs> All right. That's Buzz Lightyear. What up? What does Buzz say? <laughs> All right. See you guys. Bye. It's pretty good. Oh my goodness, Buzz Lightyear almost went flying. You better get some balance, Buzz. Buzz Lightyear trying to take off. <laughs> What's up, Mike? Tell everybody hello. We have 500 people on here right now. Oh, already? Already. Oh, we have a trailer. We have a trailer coming. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. What's up? So we're gonna do. We are gonna answer a few fishing questions. I promise you. But hey, unbeknownst to me, Tuesdays and Thursdays we're going live. Uh, it's it's Halloween, so we had to hang out a little bit. Oh, we got a load. A we have a load coming right now. Y'all come this way, so they'll knock on the door. That's kind of part of it. Let's dance with the cat. Yes. Oh, that's Simata. I see. It looks like Lacey. Oh my goodness. They have to say trick or treat, by the way. Ready? Yes, you have to say it. We have a guest appearance, guys. We have a guest appearance. World, fam world famous worm right there. That's right. You saw him at the airboat boat ramp. That's right. He gets a little nervous in front of the camera. You do? You do? Say hey. Hi, people. <laughs> All right. All right. What's up, fellas? There's Batman. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's sweet. Hugs, I like it. Can I get a hug too? Can I get a hug? Oh, look at that. I love that. That's a good hug. That's hugs right there. Hugs and treats. Oh, here comes the cat. Oh my goodness, who's that? I don't know. That's her dad. Is that her dad, really? He has a devil mask underneath that. He does what? He has a devil mask underneath that. No way. No way. Goodness gracious. All right, we're about to get jump scared. Oh my Cover your eyes. Cover your eyes. <laughs> it's a kitty cat rat. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Uh oh. It's like the funniest time someone fell. Uh oh. The cat's dancing. <laughs> I'm kind of creeped out right now. <laughs> Not as creeped out as I was when I saw you walk in with an ostrich, but I'm good with it now. That's your, that's your buddy. That's your buddy. We're about to get jump scared by the cat devil. The cat guy kind of freaked me out. The cat guy kind of freaked me out. What do you think, guys? Do you think the cat guy was a little freaky? Yeah. It was kind of freaky, actually. We kind of, we just actually just shut the door on cat guy, didn't we? What's up? Freaky for sure. Absolutely, that was freaky. I thought the cat dude was freaky. Okay, very freaky. All right. Did you see the cat? Oh, there you are, Joy. Hey, say hi, Joy. We only have 500 people on here right now. See, everybody, everybody's very nervous when I whip out the camera because it's always just spur of the moment. We have Reed here with his girlfriend, Jaden. Say hello. What's up? We're just doing a little Halloween party. That's right. I like your outfit. Your outfit's very sharp. That's right. I like it. Your opposite. Did you uh, yeah get your mechanic suit on? That's right. 
Oh my goodness. We got a sandwich. Yes, we will, guys. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Look, this is kind of crazy. So we're not sitting in the man cave. We're not talking about tournament stuff right now. We are going to answer a few fishing questions. But just to keep it fair, keep you guys interested, all you have to do is comment on the Instagram post that I made saying I was going live, the picture of me in the office with Brandon in the background. Just drop a comment. Just drop a comment, and uh, we're going to pick somebody from that to win something. I don't know if it's going to be a live target lure, if it's going to be a box of pea line, whatever it may be. But all I know is that we're going to pick one of you guys just for hanging out. So here we, go. we got somebody else. Oh, my goodness. Hello. What's up? All right, what are y'all? I'm Halo. He's Halo. Halo? Man, look, hey, Optic Hex would like that. Hector would like this. He's Halo. Oh, yeah. Nice. And what are you? Clown. Nice. Where's your bull? Ha ha. Ha ha. All right. Now, what are you, what are you dressed up as? My dad says. Oh, you're like an ATF agent or something, right? Let me check your credentials here. I don't know. That's a Legoland license that I got a while really? ago. Really? I don't know. Pretty I, official to me. It's kind of like police. Yes. I think it's oh my goodness, who are these guys? Are you not spinning my nose? There's Jazzy. Say what's up. Hi. All right. What's up, dude? <laughs> All right. That's pretty good. Hey, bust out your, your phone real quick and just knock out a, a real quick. Q and A for everybody. We've been on about six and a half minutes, and uh, we're not gonna have time for a lot of questions. So we will definitely hit you guys on the next. That's Mario. What's up, dude? Are you putting that on YouTube? Yes, it's on YouTube. Tell everybody hello. Hi. Don't lick it. I want to lick people. Don't lick my phone. This person hasn't got candy. Oh, he needs candy, guys. Come on. We're leaving. We're leaving him hanging. Oh. All right, now we have the boys just showed up. We have Nick and Kyler just showed up. And Poppy. Poppy, what's up? What's up? What's up? Tell everybody hello. Hello. All right. So it is starting to load up. The whole neighborhood is starting to load up, guys. Here comes some more. All right, so here's what we're going to do, guys, because it's going to get a little crazy because the kids are starting to come out. Hey, yo, ostrich. Yo, yo, ostrich. Come on, come on in, ostrich. So here's what we're going to do. We're gonna, we don't have a lot of time to do a lot of Q&As. Again, the Halloween thing kind of blitzed us on this deal. There's a unicorn coming right now, actually, dude. Check that out. There's a unicorn coming. For real. Dude, that's crazy. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Throw out a question for me. Make it good, though. We're not reviewing these, by the way. Have you fished Toledo Bend Reservoir? Have I officially been? Yes, I did. I officially have been Reservoir. Who's that from, by the way? Dalton.tk. Dalton. 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 One twenty-seven. One twenty-seven. Yes, I have fished uh, Toledo Bend. It's actually a great lake. We did a sight fishing show there with Todd Castledine back, I don't know, probably three years ago. So it's actually on the channel, and check it out. I did it with Clark Willett, Todd Castledine, and Russell Cecil, and that was a mega bag of big old fish on beds. It's a great lake. What's the best trailer for flipping jigs? Asked by Gaines Alexander. Gaines Alexander asked what's the best trailer for flipping jigs. It just depends. Here's what you have to figure out. It's not the best trailer. It's the best type of trailer, right? It's the best type of trailer, meaning is it, it has an action or is it kind of a subtle non-action? Like a zoom chunk, for example, doesn't have a lot of action. But if you put on like a Bruiser Crazy Craw or a strike king rage crawl lots of action so really it's more or less about action or no action it just depends a lot of times in the winter they like non-action so this is getting into the time of year where they like a little bit slower glide they don't like a lot of action so zoom super chunk something like that doesn't have a whole lot of action would be good all right i'm gonna answer one coming here all right best bait from citrus county hookers florida all right Interesting name. Actually, I saw you guys uh, not too long ago. So best setup for suspended bass. Yeah, he's on there actually as well. Best setup for suspended bass. You get a couple options. One would be a spy bait. Spy bait's pretty good right now. Spy bait, rig that up on a, you know, you can even rig it up on a bait caster. They cast really good. Bring it on 10 pound, peel on fluorocarbon, long cast, let the bait sink down to the proper depth, reel it in real slow. 
Uh, the second bait that's good for suspended bass is obviously a suspending jerk bait. Uh, you can do like a regular diving suspended jerk bait that gets down about five to six foot, or you can do a deep diving suspended jerk bait that gets down to about 10 to eight to 10 foot basically on 10 pound line. So that's what, that's what, oh, let me tell you this guys. So we have a video dropping tomorrow. So I should have actually said this right off the bat. Video dropping tomorrow. Now look, we put fish and tips on the channel. We do. We're getting reverb. All right, we put fish and tips on the channel, but we have a fish and tip tomorrow. It's a three part series. It's awesome. Okay, now three part series. There's three awesome fish and tips in the video, right, Brandon? Let me tell you, you have to watch this thing. So listen, watch it tomorrow. We're going to upload it tomorrow afternoon. Definitely have to watch that. If you love fishing, you got to watch this fishing tip. It's got some juice in there that you just don't get anywhere else. I promise you. So check it out. Thank you for that. Yes. Thank you for saying my house is nice. It's, uh, it's, I've been very blessed to have a nice home here, but I got a lot of kids. You got to have a little bit of room. So down here in Florida, you know, you got to have a little bit of space. All right. Favorite. Let's see. Let's see. Let me, I'm going to answer another question here live. So yes, there will be me. an Africa video. Yes, Africa <laughs> video. The Africa video, we are actually going to start editing that most likely tomorrow or Thursday. 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 We're going to start editing. That stuff's going to start dropping on the channel the following week for about a week. So that stuff's going to be awesome. Tons of stuff to go through. It's going to be really, really good. When are you coming through Oklahoma? I have no idea, but let me tell you something, dude. Justin Pittman. I'm coming to Oklahoma. I still have an old family house, my my family does, in Paul's Valley, Oklahoma. And uh, I want to go there and fish Lake Arbuckle. I want to fish the Paul's Valley City Lake. There's just some really cool and unique places I want to go fish in and around Paul's Valley, Oklahoma. So I don't know if you're near there, but if you are, I will definitely let everybody know I'm going to be in the area around Oklahoma, Paul's Valley area at some point. Might be the spring, but I'm coming. I promise. I promise. Okay. All right, throw out another, another one for me, if you don't mind. He's got his, yes. Are you looking in your ostrich pouch for that? Deep in the ostrich pouch. Got it. <laughs> All right, guys, again, appreciate y'all hanging out. I know this isn't the, the best uh, live ever, but you know what? Every Tuesday and every Thursday, we're going to come to you live. We're going to try to come to you live if we have phone service, no matter what we're doing or where we are, and just give you guys a peek into what we're doing, and I appreciate all the support. And if you haven't checked out the last couple videos that have been dropping, uh, check it out. Some good stuff. So, another question. What rod would you pair with the, eight, the three by one bait caster? That doesn't make sense. Skip to the next question. Okay. Because it's, you don't pair a real speed to a rod. You pair a real speed to a lure. I don't want to ask fishing questions. Okay. Well, that, that's all right. <laughs> no, no offense to whoever asked that, but let me, there's the answer. You don't pair a real speed to the rod. You pair the real speed to a rod to a lure or a technique. Meaning if you're fishing with a crankbait, you're gonna fish a little bit slower. If you're fishing lipless crankbaits and worms and things like that, you want a faster retrieve, that's what you're gonna pair it to, not the length of the rod. Let's see if you can pick another good one. Do I need to review these? What would you recommend for bass fishing in ponds around November and December with temps in the 40s and 50s? All right, so what would you recommend? Who's Who said that? Snake cub. Snake cub? Snake cub? Snake him. All right. J Snake him asked, what would you use pond fishing in ponds with water degrees temperature in the 40s, right? So basically, you know, nothing top water. You're going to want to basically get... Huh? We're getting interrupted here. So here's what you're going to want to do. Fish things low and slow on the bottom or chatterbaits. We're getting called in. I'm not sure. What's going on? What are we doing? Oh, we have the goat. This goat smells. We have the goat. This is my goat. Yes. Well, it's our goat now. Oh, okay. You That's can right. Have we actually, we love this goat. It's my goat. We love the goat. It's a real goat. It's, this is not a prop. Put him down. See if he walks. Put him oh. down. Yes. And no one has. It is a real control. goat, my friends. This is how we roll in the Martin House with the Lees, because we have goats, we have dogs, we have airboats, we have I iguanas. On Yes. Oh, where's the goat going? Oh my gosh, get the goat. Get the goat. Get the goat. Somebody get the goat. Where's the goat? We just got twenty dollars from Shane Franks. Thank you, dude. Shane Franks. Oh my gosh. 
The goat, the goat has left the building. Jesse, Jesse, the goat has left the building, my friend. It's gone. Yes. It could lay down. Come here, come here, goat. Oh my gosh, come here, come here, come here. Oh, 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 got him! I got him! I got him! Got him! Got him! I got him. Hey, goat. Let me, let me switch it around. He's trying to do it for you. There we go. We got the goat. This is real. This is really, really just a costume, actually. Yes. Goat's like, please don't whisper me. Hi, goat. Yeah. Hi, goat. Oh. Hi, goat. Wait, someone say hi to me. Somebody say. Tell everybody, Amelia. Everybody say hi, Amelia. Say hey. Someone said Scott. Y'all need a pig. Mr. Bass Outdoors. Yes, right. What's up? Hi. Look at that. Hi. Look at those people. Hi. 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 Hi, Amelia. Oh, he knows my name. That's right. Amelia loves that. Hello. Wait, someone said you're so lucky. Got tacos? Yeah. yeah. All right. No, we do Back not. Back to have the tacos. goat. Back okay. to the goat. How many people are online? Oh. Okay. Bye, goat. Be free. Okay. Be free. Be free. Did the, did the, oh my goodness. How many people are online? No, that would be bad. Don't let the goat out. That would be bad. Don't let the Come goat here, goat. Out. Come here, goat. I've totally lost track of it. We were on live that I've been chasing a goat around the house. Standing? Yes. It's not even my house. Yes. <laughs> bring the goat. To, bring the goat over here so we can trick or treat with the goat. Oh my gosh, yes. I'll go get his leash because he, yes. he won't go anywhere. Yeah. The goat's gone. The goat's gone. Is that anonymous? Well, uh, kind of, I guess. Anyway. Yes, that's anonymous. <laughs> We might need you one day. Okay, one day. <laughs> That's right. Hey, old man. People, uh, I'm, a, I'm supposed to be a crusader, like a temple knight. Keep, mm -hmm. keep thinking I'm a clansman. All, right. <laughs> All right, nice deal. All right. All right, guys. So look, here's what we're gonna do. We're getting pretty crazy right here. We have some friends over. So we have a goat, obviously. We need to know the name of the goat. What do we name the goat, okay? Drop a comment and tell me what we need to name the goat. Now, obviously, Billy the goat, we could do that, but let's get creative. So thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks for wasting 17 minutes of your life on a boring thing or whatever. So appreciate all the support guys. Again, tomorrow, got an awesome fishing tip dropping tomorrow from a very special guest. So stay tuned for tomorrow's upload. You guys have a happy Halloween. We'll see you guys. Bam!